Kia Ora everyone! Today, we're setting sail for the vibrant capital of New Zealand, Wellington. Beyond its picturesque harbour and stunning landscapes, there are some remarkable and lesser-known facts about this incredible city that are waiting to be discovered. So, join us on this adventure as we unveil the hidden gems of Wellington. Windy Wellington First things first, let's address the Windy Wellington myth. Yes, it's true. Wellington is known for its gusty winds. But did you know that the nickname actually comes from Wellington's first nickname, Port Nicholson, given by Captain William Wakefield in 1839? It was later changed to Wellington to honor the Duke of Wellington. A cinematic capital. Wellington is not just the political capital, it's also known as the Wellywood of New Zealand. Why? because it's the epicenter of New Zealand's film industry. Blockbusters like The Lord of the Rings and Avatar were brought to life in the city's studios. You can even visit Weta Workshop, where movie magic happens. Cable Car Connection The Wellington Cable Car is an iconic symbol of the city, but it's also a hidden transportation gem. It originally opened in 1902 and connects the city center with the suburb of Kelburn. Riding the cable car provides not only stunning views but also a unique way to navigate the city. Te Papa Tongarewa Treasures Te Papa Tongarewa, New Zealand's National Museum, is a treasure trove of hidden facts. One fascinating exhibit is the colossal squid, one of the largest and most mysterious creatures in the deep sea. It's a must-see for any visitor. Wellington's Underground Tavern Hidden beneath the streets of Wellington is a historic underground tavern known as the Malt House. This establishment, which dates back to the 19th century, offers an extensive selection of craft beers and is a favorite haunt for beer enthusiasts. The Beehive Building's Secrets The Beehive, Wellington's iconic parliamentary building, holds a secret. It was designed by architect Sir Basil Spence, who hid his signature within the building's design. Can you spot it when you visit? The Phoenix of the City Wellington is home to a professional football team, the Wellington Phoenix FC, who compete in the A-League. The team's symbol, the Phoenix, represents the city's resilience, rising from the ashes of past earthquakes. The birthplace of the flat white. Coffee lovers, rejoice! Wellington is credited as the birthplace of the Flat White, a beloved espresso-based drink. Introduced in the 1980s, this frothy, creamy coffee has become a Kiwi favorite and has made its mark on cafes worldwide. The Cable Car Museum Beyond its practical transport, the Wellington Cable Car has a hidden gem at its Kelburn terminus, the Cable Car Museum. It showcases the history of this iconic mode of transport including vintage cable cars and historic memorabilia. The Mysterious Red Rocks A short trip from Wellington, you'll find the Red Rocks Reserve. What makes it unique is the presence of red rocks, which are actually ancient pillow lava formations. These rocks are also home to a resident fur seal colony, adding to the area's mystique. The Famous Waterfront Fairy Tale Sculptures Along Wellington's waterfront, you'll encounter a series of sculptures inspired by famous fairy tales, like The Wind in the Willows and Alice in Wonderland. These whimsical artworks add a touch of enchantment to the city's landscape. The Cuba Street Cat Haven In the heart of the bustling Cuba Street, there's a hidden cat haven. Known as Cats of Cuba Street, this community project provides shelter and food for stray cats, creating a unique and heartwarming urban oasis. The Legendary Wellington Boot The iconic rain boot known as the Wellington Boot, or Wellies, was named after the Duke of Wellington, who was known for his strong and sturdy footwear. These boots became a fashion statement and are still essential for Wellington's unpredictable weather. The Wellington Wind Orchestra Wellington is home to a unique musical group, the Wellington Wind Orchestra. Comprising wind and brass instruments, this ensemble brings a distinctive sound to the city, entertaining audiences with their diverse repertoire. 
The Bucket Fountain Fun. Cuba Street, one of Wellington's vibrant arteries, is home to an unusual yet delightful feature, the Bucket Fountain. This kinetic sculpture has been a local favorite since the 1960s and has a mind of its own, with buckets tipping and splashing water when you least expect it. The Littlest Cinema. While Wellington is known for its film industry, it's also home to one of the world's smallest cinemas, the Paramount Cinema. Tucked away in a historic building, it offers an intimate and immersive movie-watching experience. The Karori Cemetery Staircase. The Karori Cemetery, one of New Zealand's largest cemeteries, hides an intriguing secret, the Karori Cemetery Staircase. This ornate staircase leads to nowhere, a reminder of Wellington's past when the cemetery was meant to expand beyond its current boundaries. The Tiniest Library. Wellington has a penchant for the small and unique. The city is home to New Zealand's smallest library, the Holloway Road Microlibrary. This little red telephone box has been transformed into a tiny lending library, fostering a sense of community. The Naming of Mount Victoria Mount Victoria, an iconic Wellington landmark, was originally named by the city's founder, John Plimmer, in honor of Queen Victoria. However, the Maori name for the hill, Tanji Te Keo, means, weeping parrot. Both names coexist, reflecting the city's cultural diversity. The world's southernmost brewery. If you're a beer enthusiast, you'll be delighted to know that Wellington boasts the world's southernmost brewery, the Garage Project. It's known for its experimental and creative brews that have gained international acclaim. The Wellington Blitzball. During World War II, Wellington experienced the Blitzball. Instead of hiding in shelters, Wellingtonians defiantly danced the night away in underground venues, showcasing the city's indomitable spirit. The Bay Area's Marine Life Wellington's harbors are teeming with marine life, including a resident population of little blue penguins. These adorable creatures are the world's smallest penguin species and can often be spotted near the waterfront, adding a touch of wildlife to the city. The Canterbury Earthquake Connection The city's historic Old Street Paul's Cathedral is more than a century old and has a fascinating connection to another New Zealand city. Its timber comes from the Canterbury region, transported to Wellington by sea and then used to construct this stunning architectural gem. The Treasured Catherine Mansfield House Catherine Mansfield, a renowned New Zealand author, spent her childhood in Wellington. Her former home is now the Catherine Mansfield House and Garden, a museum dedicated to her life and work, providing a glimpse into the writer's early years. The Steepen Streets of Wellington Wellington boasts some of the steepest residential streets in the world. For instance, Baldwin Street in Dunedin is famous for being the steepest, but Kelburn Parade in Wellington is no slouch either. It's a workout just to walk up these inclines. The Seven Shapeshifters Seven Shapeshifters is a captivating sculpture on Wellington's waterfront. This artwork, inspired by Maori mythology, portrays seven mythical creatures known as Tanifa and adds a touch of mysticism to the cityscape. The Wooden Water Tank House Nestled in Wellington's Botanic Garden is the Wooden Water Tank House, an architectural gem. This structure served as a reservoir for the city's water supply and is a hidden historical treasure. The Victoria University Murals Victoria University's Hunter Building is adorned with a series of striking murals by New Zealand artist Colin McCann. These murals, while lesser known, are considered some of McCann's early masterpieces and showcase his talent. The Royal Oak Pub's Tree Connection The Royal Oak Pub in Miramar has a unique secret, a tree grows through its roof. Instead of removing the tree, the pub was built around it creating an unusual and charming atmosphere for patrons. The Artistic Underpass The Plimmer's Arc Underpass, located near the waterfront, is not your typical pedestrian tunnel. It's adorned with vibrant, ever-changing street art, making it a dynamic and artistic passageway for those exploring the city on foot. The Mysterious Thorndon Spiral 
The historic Thorndon Spiral Railway track is a marvel of engineering. It's a hidden gem for train enthusiasts, as it features a unique spiral loop that allows trains to navigate steep terrain, creating a captivating visual spectacle. The sinking of the SSMAHENO Wellington's coast holds a secret beneath the waves, the wreckage of the SS Maheno. This ship, which served as a hospital ship during World War I, ran aground and now rests on the ocean floor, offering a haunting glimpse into history for divers. The Melrose Water Park Mystery The Melrose Water Park is an abandoned, eerie relic from the past. This outdoor pool was once a popular destination but has been closed for years, leaving it shrouded in mystery and a popular spot for urban explorers. The Funky City Sculptures Wellington streets are filled with quirky sculptures, from the famous Bucket Fountain to the quirky sculptures in Cuba Street. These artworks add character to the city and are often a source of delight and amusement for residents and visitors alike. The Vibrant Cuba Street Carnival Wellington's Cuba Street comes alive every year with the vibrant Cuba Dupa Festival. This colorful street carnival features live music, performances, street art, and culinary delights, creating an electric atmosphere for all to enjoy. Wellington, with its tree-growing pubs, artistic underpasses, and historic railway spirals, continues to amaze us with its hidden treasures. Have you come across any of these lesser-known facts about Wellington? Share your experiences and thoughts in the comments below. And if you're eager for more intriguing discoveries, don't forget to subscribe. Hera!